Now, good morning everybody and thank you for watching ASFN Fishing. To all the guys that subscribed and like our videos, thank you very much. That really helps us. And if you haven't subscribed yet, guys, make sure you subscribe. Push that little bell button and you will get notified every time we upload a video. It's our mission to share everything with you guys with regards to tackle, methods, baits, areas, fishing news, anything we can that will get you better results. And that we've done for 15 years. Support us by liking this video. That really helps us on YouTube and subscribe to our channel. Thank you very much. Now guys, today more toys. We have announced this in the past that it's coming and it's finally here. It's available. And that is the four piece grinder elites. A slightly marginally thinner rod and can break up in four pieces. Now what does that mean? All right. For any angler who owns a double cab bucky that is not an Amarok will know that a 15 foot when technology moved us to 15 foot rods three piece they don't fit in the bins you can't just flick them into the bin uh, they don't comfortably fit in most bins now now with the Amarok I don't have that problem but a lot of guys do have that problem and even in your vehicle in your boot it's been a problem that the guys can't fit it now why didn't the guys do this way back when already with the introduction of grinder rods the guys moved over to spigots and that's the joints we use okay now a spigot in most cases and in most rods creates a flat spot but when it comes to diver rods they don't because of a technology called v-joint technology where they use the technology to the the actual insert and the joints flex at exactly the same curve test curve and parabolic action of the whole rod in other words by having the V joint spigot joints on the Daiwa rods, you don't have any flat spots. Most other rods, that is a bit of a problem. So when you add another piece or another joint, you've got an additional flat spot. So by having two flat spots, you'll have three. But because of the V joint technology, that doesn't happen in uh, Daiwa rods, which is proprietary technology to Daiwa only a real breakthrough when it comes to spigot joints now guys just to put put this in perspective exact same rod same action but in a four piece now what does that mean in physical length when these rods are broken up the three piece is 1.6 meters which makes it difficult to fit in a lot of boots or bins of double cab buckies and various other other issues of fitting it into small cars now what what happened with making it a four piece it took it down to 1.2 meters which is 40 centimeters that makes a massive difference if you consider the two this will hold them together for you so you can see that big big difference in length now as i mentioned earlier also marginally thinner rod and not more in weight really so by keeping all the qualities the action the parabolic action of the three piece 15 foot you now get a four piece and that's for absolute convenience fitting it easily into your car your boot or your double cab bin guys definitely a rod to to look at and definitely the future of grinder the longer grinder rods and it's great to see these developments and progression in our tackle that makes it easier for us to fish more convenient yet with advanced power compared to what we used to and uh, the technology how it's going forward is just great in fishing so really a great company to work with Dawa thank you very much they adapted this as you guys probably know the grind elite is specifically built for South African conditions and when you have to compare it to the grinder rods out there this is a rod with serious backbone okay you load this rod you use a heavier sinker and you push and you can get really really distinctive distances on your cast and accuracy because of the fast taper and the serious backbone this rod's got most of its action sit in the top third slowly moving down uh, and getting less and less into the butt you'll see a lot of the rods bent from the butt um, which makes it almost yeah almost our old carp rod type of actions that allows for casting in any which way it's very important that when you get a grind elite the benefit is that you've got serious pulling action it gives you extra sensitivity but 
you must keep in mind that you must load this rod. So rather use a seven, eight ounce sinker when casting this rod than a six or even a five, regardless of your bait size. Guys, so at your closest tackle store, nationwide, go and ask and have a look at the Grind Elite four piece, which I think is revolutionary in the type of fishing we do. So well done, Daiwa. And thank you guys for watching. We'll make sure we bring you the latest on a regular basis. We're currently on five videos a week, at least, and that will go up soon. We'll be adding a whole bunch of additional material to our bouquet that we bring you on a weekly basis. Please subscribe and like this video. Thanks again. Thank